Hey guys, Magnus Robert here bringing you another video. Today we're going to be buying the Summer Games Villa with the Summer Games dude <laughs> for 150 donuts. So we we're going to place it over here with my Summer Games stuff. So, uh, yeah, new premium character. Pretty cool this update has been. So I win the trophy for Chip. For charging, sorry, for charging cities huge fees to host sporting events. So the Summer Games Chairman, that's his name. So he goes to the Springfield Games, completes that category. Oh, he's got voice. Maybe the world no longer has a place for a person whose existence revolves around people briefly caring about international sports every four years. I watched the games. You were the head guy, weren't you? Yes. Yes. Yeah. But that doesn't mean a lick around here. Well, it does to me. You might be the only person in Springfield that actually knows how to wear a suit instead of selling major cities on hosting expensive... Instead of selling major cities on hosting uh, expensive events, how about selling houses, house hunters on expensive property? Hmm. Oh, great. Hmm. Are you... any of them international house hunters? So make the summer chair... Summer Games Chairman Bark at his real estate bus bench at... I imagine that would just be a right bench. Oh no. Is that real too busy? I just don't get the point of adding the cowboy hat to my photo. Trust me, cowboys sell houses. I thought you hired me for my eloquence and sophistication. Eloquence and sophistication. I did. That's why in Waverly Hills I dropped off bottles of, of champagne with your face on them. That gets people to buy houses? Not necessarily, but if you do... Do it at least 50 gimmicks, one is bound to work, if you do at least 50 gimmicks. Real estate is so boring, it's like a thousand emails back and forth about listing listings that are free to look at on Zillow. If you're so bored doing real estate, Mr. Summer Chairman, our youth hockey league could use some help organising a tournament. Hockey? That's a winter sport. I deal exclusively in summer sports. Winter, summer, isn't organising just organising? Ha! Organising a sport event is a, it's a sacred art. There are rules. Arbitrary rules. Ignore the rules. We need your expertise. Man, you think people would take it easy with all the sports right now? But I'll do it if you let me coach. Okay, great. Chief Wiggum, you're fired. Is it because I made Ralph the, st the starting goalie? I'm a great Zambon. I'm the great Zambon. So, Coach Lisa's Youth Hockey League. So, it goes there. Here you go kids, just cover these expenses and then we can get started on scheduling the tournament. We're just kids, the only money we have are checks from our grandparents which we don't know how to cash because checks are old fashioned. Is that how you spell checks in America? No money, but but this is a sport, can't you just charge the, a city at random, a random field something? Oh, nope, not him. Mr. Summer Chairman, I know your background is is in the money laundering bribe machine that is the international sports, but youth sports isn't about money. Youth sports are about giving young people an opportunity to learn how to trust one another and play together as a team. That's not what it's about. It's about the it's a way for our parents to get rid of their kids for a few hours so they can eat all the good food out of the fridge and leave us with the scraps. I think that's just dad, but yeah. Look, Mr. Summer Chairman, if hockey isn't your thing, there are lots of other youth sports you could in Springfield you could help us organise. Hmm, all Springfield sports. So examine sports equipment. I'll have to just quickly do that and do that. So he's got a hat, he's looking at it, he's like, nah. He's got whatever that is. And he throws it, he's like, nah, he's got, a, oh, he's got a swimming pool. Ah, uh, but it de-inflates. He's got that thing again. Whatever the hell that is. He's got the hat, yeah, I think that's a repeat. The basketball hoops are square, the volleyball courts upside down, and the track spells out the name Mr. Burns. The S is a dollar sign. And look at all these footballs, they're all deflated. Who's your equipment manager, Tom Brady? No, his name is Groundskeeper Willie, but I wouldn't mess with him. He's He has a shotgun mounted into his tractor. This is a mockery. How are people supposed to play sports without proper equipment? Summer, summon every Springfielder you can find. What are you going to do? What I do best, child. What I do best. So, chair a meeting. 
So here he is, Chang is meeting. He's saying no, no, no. <laughs> and he's ordering about uh, a meeting about basketball hoops needing to be round. This is so boring. He does, he does look really happy. Sports do weird things to adults. Want to learn another TikTok dance? Sorry. Are we endorsing TikTok? Okay, but I get to choose. Dancing. This one I'm calling the Van Houten Shuffle. Let, let me teach you. Thank you for helping, Lisa, but I'm afraid Springfielders don't really care about the quality sport facilities and equipment. I'm sorry, but I'm sure they must be some place in Springfield where you'd fit in. I guess I could go back to being a real estate agent. Hey, top seller. I sold something? Your ad with the cowboy hat is working wonders. I've sold 20 houses just because I put the cowboy version of you on the listings. 20 houses? And all you got to do is change out your fancy suit and put on the cowboy hat. This cowboy hat. Yeehaw. So me. win gold in the real estate game. So that's it. So we got... Examine sports equipment, admire his brilliance, have a paper sex on the beach, date the swallow, try and win a blackjack, drink a babysit, attend parenting seminars, get a new suit, dance the Samuel Burns, chair a meeting, trim up the beard, and wallow in self-doubt. And real quick, we're just going to scan all, all the way. The reason I'm being really quick and trying to talk really fast is because my game keeps disconnecting and I can't be... It's taken, like, years to reconnect. It's taken forever. So, that's the noise. Bringing clean towels from the unpenthant time. Yeah, I think for a, an unnamed character, this character is really, really cool. And I, I really like this building as well. It looks really nice. I love the kind of cobblestone feel to it. Yeah, really cool character, really cool building. I would definitely recommend. It's a good combo, I'd say. The character's got voice. He's got some, you know, he's got some decent tasks and decent animations. And the quest line was, was okay. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed. Tell me your thoughts on this item. And yeah, I shall see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.